one. So the first 15 minute routine coming your way, focus on the upper body predominantly, work in all areas, but your upper body is gonna get a little bit of extra hit and focus with some plank and push up variations. Heart rate will get up, 15 minute session. Following week, another 15 minutes. Week after that, another 15 minutes. Preparing you for that 45 minute routine at the end of the month, all right? As you can see, clean shaven. <laughs> we shall see how, uh, how my mo grows over the month, all right? Hopefully you're in with me and you're gonna enjoy this. Um, let's go. Okay, everyone, we're gonna start with a warm up, warming your body up, what I call quick feet. So we're literally marching on the spot, hardly lifting the feet up from the side. You can see I'm hardly lifting my foot off the ground, but I'm moving my feet and legs quite quickly. All right, arms just gently moving. And we're gonna go slow, and then we're gonna speed it up, all right? So let's start to increase the speed. And slowing it down, all right? Slowing it down, so slow, quick feet. Zip up your tummy from the middle. Try and keep your core nice and still and prevent your pelvis from wibbly wobbling in the middle, all right? Speeding up in three, two, one, go. Five, four, three, two, one. Slowing it down, okay, walking. So walking, opposite arm and leg, core nice and still, fire up your abs, prevent your pelvis from bopping up and down, all right? So that's what I want it to look like. This would be bopping. Can you keep your pelvis still and level? Okay. You can see my legs are in a slight squat position. Sitting back into my glutes. Shoulders up, all part of the warm up. All right, and load your legs and arms in the warm up. Focusing then on your upper body as things progress through the session. All right, back to quick feet. So, flat feet. Pumping through your legs into the floor. Speeding it up in three, two, one. Elevate the arms, go. Five, four, three, two, one. And back down again. Okay. Again, elevate the arms, speed it up. Five, four, three, two, one. Back to the front. Normal space, normal speed. Right, lift it up, go. Five, four, three, two, one, and back down. Get it with the arms, speed it up. Five, four, three, two, one. With the arms, right, as you're reaching up, just tuck myself in here. You can see me exposing my belly. Kind of a little tuck in. Right, here we go. As you lift the arms up, you want to reach. Reach the arms, speed it up. Go on, five. Four, reach, three, squat lower, two, one. In the standing, marching, walking. Heart rate starting to elevate, starting to get your body nice and warm. Now with the quick feet, we're gonna continue to elevate the arms up and down, all right? So normal speed, when I say normal speed, moderate pace. Elevate the hands. Bring them back down again. Elevate the hands, bring them back down again. So that's what we're gonna do with the arms. Get ready to speed it up. We're gonna go a little bit quicker, a little bit longer. 10 seconds this time. The arms continue to move. Are you ready? Go in three, two, one, go. Two, and one, okay. Little roll down, chin to chest, let's articulate the spine. Roll that body forward, roll your body, and we're gonna walk out on our hands. One, two, three, four, in the push up position. Hold that shape, small little dip. Walk back to the hands, drive up through the legs. Roll to the end. Roll, just loosen up the spine. Walk on the hands. One, two, three, four. Feet go back. Hold the position. Little push up. Up you come. Walk back to the feet. So it's a low squat. 
Roll down in. Walk out, go. Hold the plank. Push up position. Hips are down. Breath in, breath out, up. Back you come. Drive through the legs. This time I'm going to come into low squat, walk out. I'm going to start to speed up a little bit. One, one, two, three, four. Push. Down. One, two, three, four. Press. One, two, three, four. Up, go. One, two, three, four. Try and alternate the hand that leads first, yeah? So change which hand is leading on the way out and on the way back. Think about bringing your chest over your hands. You are in charge of the depth of the push-up. If it's too hard, you have an option to do it on your knees. Press yourself back up and then go, all right? So there's your default knee push-up. If I'm tipping those, it's too much for you. Okay, another three. Up you come. Two more. Moving, keep driving through those legs, pushing the body up. Okay, getting ready for quick feet. Quick feet. So it's a short video. I'm going to keep you moving. Moderate pace with the legs. Speeding it up now, please, for five, four, three, two, and one. Back into that roll down first. One with a roll down, walk it out, press up, walk it back. Option to do this on your knees, we drive out the squat. Okay, this time, come down into the squat, into the walk out. So no roll down, we're just squatting into it, hit it low, sticking the bottom backwards as you do the movement. Squat back, walk out, press, push. Keep your breathing. Think about breathing in as you lower, breathe out on the uplift. Walk back to your feet. Continue, two left. Remember, hold it in your hands. If you remember, sometimes your dominant hand will like to leave the charge. Quick feet on the spot, on the spot. Abs on, arms lifted, lowering. Lift in, lower in. Take the opportunity, take some air in, breathe in through the nose, out through your mouth, fill the lungs. Speeding it up in three, two, one, go. Quick step, five, four, three, two, one. Okay, play a squat on the side bend. A bit of active recovery. Sit back into your bottom, get a nice stretch through the upper body, straight from the side. Sink it back, come over onto one leg, other leg extends. Squat down, over onto one leg, come over to the other side. Continue. Take the opportunity to fill the lungs up, get some air in, get ready for the next exercise. Okay, next exercise, we're going to be coming down into a low squat. The feet will be wide like this, and you'll pop your hands between your legs, and we go into that walkout exercise. Difference being, rather than doing a push-up, we're going to do some Spider-Mans, all right? So we're going to be running the legs in and out, and we're going to think about not letting the bottom bop up and down. Still strong. Push up plank position, the last one of these. Here we go. Okay, keep the legs nice and wide. Come into that squat position, walk it out. Once you're in that position, nice flat back. One, two, one, two. Keep going. Two more. Walk back. Drive through the legs. Down, other hand leads. 20 this time if you can. One, two, one. Your chest over your hands. Walk 
back, right for your legs. This time we're going to be 10, but we're going to go as quick as you can manage. Here we go, nice and fast. So nice and quick, back to feet, little jump, back out, 10, here we go. Back with come, little jump. 15, or should I say 16? Back we come, little jump. Here we go, walk it out. And again, strong position, then go. Back. Last time, 20. Come on. Strong position. Now let the legs go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Forget your jump up. Don't forget your jump up. Little drink. Little drink. Okay, get ready. Next exercise. Hopefully you're sweating. Okay, on the spot. Quick feet, arms going. Reaching the arms. Quarter turn to your right. Speed up the legs. Go. Three, two, one. Come in. Keep the arms going. Turn the other direction. Speed up for five, four, three. Two, one, back in. Okay, get ready. Wide the legs. Come with me now. Squat low. Walk out with the hands. Now watch the knees. Knee to opposite elbow. Keep your chest forward. Relax through your shoulders. Three, two, one. Walk back. Little jumps. Soft landing. Walk out. Same again. Back we go, guys. Nice jump. Two more rounds. Walk it out. Nice and strong. Back you come. Remember the jump. Soft landing. Last round. Come on, nice and strong. Chest over hands, get forward on the tippy toes. Squeeze your core, squeeze those abs. One, two, go, back. Nice jump. Feet. Arms elevated. 10 second burn off with the legs, with the quick feet. We're gonna keep the arms up and we're gonna reach with the hands. Speeding up in three. Legs are bent, look. Two, one, are you ready? Go. 10, nine, eight, as quick as you can. Seven, six, reach the arms. Four, three, two, one. Missed out a couple seconds there, didn't I? Play a squat, side bend. Here we go. Sit back in your bottom. Stretch off your side. Sit back in your glutes. Over. Two more. Just stand in last drill. What you started with, which was that squat low, walk out, give me a push up, come back, jump up, soft landing. Eight. Quick as you can. Are you ready? Root strength. Find that nice alignment first. Are you ready? Three, two, one, go. Too much. 
Vind meer voor omhoog. Squat. Squat bend. Breath in. Breath out. Well done. Heart rate should be up. Sometimes, if your heart rate's not up, with that, like mine is, you can see I'm having a pause at the sentences. High intensity interval training should give you that feeling. But if that's not happening, despite you moving quickly with me, what that's suggesting is perhaps positioning might not be quite right. Therefore, you're not challenging your body in a way it needs to be challenged to get the desired result. Right, that's why I come in with my glasses. Right, little pinch me there. Okay, so your heart rate's not up. Don't feel it in your chest and your legs. You need to get in touch with me, yeah? Because you definitely should have your positioning was spot on. Okay, stretch for the arms with your hands. Reach forward, round the shoulders a little bit. Okay, from here, open up the chest, turn the palms, breath in, you're gonna set your arms up. A little extension at the top. Lower the arms. Open up the chest. Get all those lungs up, relax that body. Okay, little quad stretch. All right, take hold of your foot, your sock, or if not, get a towel, t-shirt, or whatever around your foot if you're not flexible enough to stretch the front of your thigh. I'll show you what I mean with a t-shirt. If you're flexible enough, keep holding that stretch. Yeah, like so, yeah. You want to feel your muscle, no knee pain. If you've got knee pain, it stretches it for you. Again, you need to get in touch. legs. Hold on if need be. Stretch the front of the thigh. Breathe in. Reach small. Lift your chest. Okay. Session one. Session two next week. Try and get this in two or three times if you can over the next week. Okay. Next installment coming. Again, you're going to aim for the same. We will double up the session. And you double up the session slightly different thing. Right, stay disciplined. Discipline is key. Yeah, with everything that's going on. Stay disciplined, everyone. Stay focused. Stay with it. Keep ticking off. Good habits. Regular routine. We'll do this together, yeah? We're gonna see how, uh, how the mode grows. Hopefully, you're gonna stay with me on this. All right, well done.